All right, so I've been talking to you a lot about the thoracic spine and its influence on shoulder mobility, especially in overhead and shoulder injuries. So uh, I've shown you several drills on how to increase thoracic extension and rotation. This is just another one. I love this one. I think it's one of the most effective quick wins that you can do for yourself. Uh, I got it originally from a guy named Greg Rose. He's with the Titleist Performance Institute. And uh, uh, it totally changed the way I am approaching thoracic mobility. So what he had said was one of the best ways to in improve a joint's mobility is through joint distraction, meaning you're kind of pulling the joint apart away from itself. And uh, you know, you see it all the time in the CrossFit gym. We get bands, we wrap them around our hip, put them around our shoulder. We end up making um, you know, some range of motion gains because of that. So how do we do that to the rib cage and the thoracic spine? And he had said breathing. And a lot of the breathing stuff that I've already talked to you about, or that I will talk to you about in the future, is through diaphragmatic breathing. This is not that, okay? It's a big chest breath, and it's totally the antithesis. It's the opposite of what I've been telling a lot of people to do for a long time. So uh, essentially what we're gonna do is sit with uh, our knees bent to about 90 degrees, and we're gonna cross one leg over the other. In this case, it's gonna be left over right, and I'm gonna be rotating to my left. So hands behind the head, get tall, and I'm gonna rotate to the left. Before I do anything, I'm gonna look just to see sort of where I'm pointing and I'm pointing, I don't know, 30, 40 degrees off to, to my left here. So I'm gonna rotate, now I'm gonna lean to the left, so I'm gonna lateral bend left, keep my legs together, and then I'm gonna cycle two big chest breaths. So here, big chest breath. Two, okay, I'm not gonna come back, I'm gonna um, tilt back up to a neutral, I'm gonna rotate a little bit further, Lean back, two big breaths. Come back upright, rotate a little bit further. Lean, two more breaths. And I'm gonna come back. Now I'm gonna retest. And I've already gained, I don't know, 10 degrees maybe and do that to both sides, and do that every day. You'll notice a huge change in how much extension and rotation, uh, excuse me, extension and rotation that you get at your thoracic spine.